Hi everyone, welcome to another video for Philips Take-On DDS CAD. Whether in a traditional CAD or BIM workflow, 2D documentation including cross-section is highly important. For information to be consistent in the model and documentation, DDS CAD provides intelligent text and dimension lines. But before viewing the video, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell to be notified of new videos. Enjoy! In DDS CAD, cross sections can be instantly generated. To do so, we use the function sections and we click on the new section button. And we just have to give three clicks to start, to give the length and to give the depth. And the section is instantly created for the discipline and level activated. And we double click to open it. In this cross section, we can insert intelligent text called part text. This part text can be preset. For this board selected, we can have the information such as the description of it. And by pressing tab in a selected product, it will display the preset part text. And of course, you could create a new configuration. Or for this socket, we can insert the product, num uh, the product description and the mounting height. The same for the switch and the thermostat. For the fluorescent lamp, we can insert that it has two bulbs of 58 watts. That's cool, isn't it? Moreover, for this section in the sanitary heating, we already have some dimension lines and a part text with the mounting height and the size of the pipe. I will create more dimension lines for this cross section, starting on the bottom and connecting to some objects. As you can see, when the the node of the dimension line uh, of the dimension line is connected, it will be highlighted like this. And bear in mind, I'm connecting now to this valve and to this band above, and I will press Enter and attach this dimension line. From this dimension line, I can create from extend like this. Now let's pretend that I would in the future move the valve uh, mounting height. And I could do this in another environment, like in a 3D view. And I would like to align this valve to the valve below. So I will move down 20 centimeters like this. If I come back to the cross section, the node of this dimension line would follow as it should work in a beam workflow. At last but not least, pipes and ducts can have a solid fuel representation. To do so, we come to the view and activate the solid fuel for ducts and pipes. Do you like this video? Do you want to know more about DDS CAD? Put your comment below and we get back to you. Cheers!